the leaf blower strikes again. <laughs> excited to be here because we're doing a Walmart haul and I have some really good finds. Now there's like a full on, sounds like a wolf howling in ambulances. Is it a full moon or something? What's happening today? I'm gonna be trying stuff on. I have a lot of really cute clothing items, some jewelry accessories, hair stuff, beauty, and it's exciting because I'm working with Walmart for this video. So thank you to them for sponsoring today's video. I got to pick out all the items I'm featuring. So this is literally just a Walmart haul. I'm gonna have everything linked down below in the description box if you wanna shop any of these items on walmart.com. Also, I use I have all my time limits set to apps. I like shopping either on desktop or on their app. And I do have the Walmart Plus subscription. I've been a member since 2022. So whenever I think of an item I need, I can just like easily add it to my cart on here. Walmart's been stepping it up. I feel like they have some super cute fashion items. They're affordable. <laughs> Now our wolf dog is freaking out. I'm in San Diego. YouTube keeps like making it harder and harder to find the description box. So now on videos, I am pinning a comment with the description box there as well. So you can check the comment section to find the links too. We're doing what must be done over here. Here we go. Let's start off with one of the items that I am most in love with. This necklace. I've been looking for one of these like chunky chain kind of necklaces like this. It's so cute on its own or you can like layer it with, you know, like a shorter choker or longer necklace. I just love the chunky look lately. It's so funny how trends with everything change so much. Now we're going back to low rise jeans. I don't know about that, but I can get on board with the chunky jewelry trend coming back. Remember back in the day when there were like the big chunky heart charm bracelets? It's not too heavy too, like on your neck. I don't know, it's comfortable. And then we have this top. So it's like this off the shoulder. It's like a light sweater material where I actually wore this blue one. I was just in Phoenix and it was 119 degrees. I went there during record breaking heat, but this sweater material is like light enough to wear. I felt fine wearing it in that weather. Obviously I'm not like walking miles in 119 degree heat or anything. I just was going in and out of AC, but I got this beautiful teal color. This one's a size small and then the pink one's a size medium. I do like the fit of the small better on me. So I would say it runs a little bit big. I personally love the look of off the shoulder. I think it's so flattering. This one's cropped, but on me, it's like long enough to where it's not, I'm not like showing the middle. This one smells good. It smells like my perfume. <laughs> really comfortable and it's not like a itchy sweater material. This one is like totally comfortable, not scratchy, not itchy. So this is a total win. This guy I am so curious about is the Garnier glass hair water. So this is like a thing now that's gotten really popular. It's, it's like the 10 second rinse. You put it on your hair when it's wet. Like after you shampoo it, you put it on your hair and you just let it sit on for this one is 10 seconds. It's so wild, at least the other one that I like. And it just like instantly detangles your hair, makes it so soft. The vegan formula and it says it has argan oil and plant protein. I'm curious if this one adds more shine. But I wanna go back to using something like this because I really do feel like it makes a difference with your hair. This is a repurchase and I'm excited to have these here in San Diego because I talked about this in a monthly favorites video, I wanna say a few months ago now. This is the Grow Strong line from Garnier. And when I tell you my hair has never been softer, sleeker, shinier when I use this stuff. I did it into my like travel container, so I've had it with me. I do feel like these definitely make a difference with my hair texture and just the shininess. I personally love the scent, which is weird because I'm not super into fruity scents, but to me, the apple scent just smells like very refreshing and summery. You need the shampoo and the conditioner and Walmart has a deal. Like if you buy the two in a pack, you get a little bit off. So I also wanted to try that glass water because I've just been digging these so much. Probably my most asked question over the years is where I got this ring. This was my grandma's ring. So unfortunately you cannot find this. I don't even know where she got it. But when I saw this on Walmart, I was like, okay, obviously different but similar vibe, you know what I'm saying? This is obviously bigger. It's like, you know, costume jewelry, but if you just like the look of the big black with the diamonds around it, I mean, similar kind of vibe. I'll put it on this finger. It is adjustable, here we go. But if you have small fingers, just FYI, it is a little bit big. My biggest finger is like a six and a half. Different shapes, obviously, but what do you think? Obviously I wouldn't wear this with like all these other rings probably. Another item that's a part of that ring was a part of the Sofia Vergara line and then this also is. I ended up getting these for a really good price. These jeans really surprised me. I was like, these are really gonna be hit or miss because there's no zip, there's no button. They're just like the stretchy like pull up kind of waistband and stuff. 
These actually fit so cute. I feel like they're pretty flattering on the butt. They're nice and like kind of smoothing in the stomach area. I am 4'11 forever and so I do need to get these altered quite a bit, but I'm going to because I love the fit of these. I do think the flared jeans are almost like a little bit more flattering. They just overall can make you look a little like curvier. Makes you look more proportional because it like, you know, you know what I'm saying? It's like out in the hips, in and then out. I feel like this was such a good find, really good price. And I'm super excited about these and they're comfortable too. They're stretchy, but like lightweight at the same time, but they don't feel like jeggings. They still feel like jeans. Next up we have my hair dye. This one is slightly different than the one I normally purchase. I'll put a photo on the screen here of the one I normally get. I think just the difference is that this one's the keratin color line, but this is the best blue black dye I've found, like the Schwarzkopf brand. And I feel like it just last like the blue holds well too covers grays well i have a ton of grays these days literally 40 or 50 at this point it doesn't stain my face badly like a lot of other dyes can i just feel like this is my probably my favorite line of color i've tried so far and I've been coloring my own hair for what, 13 years now? <laughs> More than that. I picked up this headband. This is from The Line with Tasha. I actually saw her talking about this on Instagram and I was, I was intrigued. I wanted to check it out anyway. It's like a faux leather headband. Ooh, wait, I like this. The thing with like headbands like this, I feel like it just gives you some volume on top. But I like this, this is cute. It has these like fun little leather look twists on here. Really like this guy. Okay, I liked this so much that I got it in two colors. This tank top, I recently wore in a video. It's $3, comes in a bunch of colors. I also got it in this beautiful like neon peach color. This, this one does something to me, this color. But I love the fit of this. It's like higher neck. It cuts kind of high in your armpits and in the back as well. The material's like so soft and it has a nice stretch to it. I have a size small in both of these and I feel like the small fits really well. $3. So if you just need an affordable tank top that comes in different color options and is comfy and is like not too low or cropped or anything like this one is not cropped at all it's hard to find things that aren't cropped these days i'm here to report that i am indeed still in my neon face so this sports bra is like slightly neon and just like a beautiful spearmint minty color i feel like the color in real life looks like so much better than how it's showing up on camera it's almost like a little too bright to show up accurately on camera. This has, I guess you'd say built-in pads. Like it does have this like pad lining, but there's not, you know, any insert pads across back, but it is adjustable right here. So you can tighten it. I'm hoping this fits. What size do I get? Got a medium in this one. And it has this nice like ribbed pattern on the side too. Okay, these glasses remind me a little bit of like, I don't even know what year. Comment down below, what year is this? You'll know, you'll know what I'm talking about when I put them on. <laughs> Like they're big, they're they're chunky, they're big, but I also kind of really like them. I think with the right outfit, this could be right. Like I wouldn't wear it with this. I don't know, I'm picturing this with like a baggy sweatshirt and leggings kind of thing just for like something more mellow and like, you know, low bun or ponytail or something. Like I think it could be really cute. I like them. Picked up this little trio of necklaces here. How beautiful are these? And I like how there's some really dainty ones down here, like very thin. I don't quite have, I feel like this thin of ones to layer. I personally love the look of this like flat style. Okay, they are necklaces. For a second I was like, wait, are these anklets? No, they are necklaces. How did I manage to get these? So Last jewelry item that I got, another three piece necklace set. I really loved this one specifically is like kind of what I got this whole thing for. I love how shiny this one is. Like look at it reflecting the light, super shiny. I think this will be a really good layering one as like this being the longest. Layering these two together would be really pretty. I also really like this one right here. It almost looks like a sun or something. For me, I just like go through white t-shirts. I feel like between makeup getting on it or staining them or like deodorant, staining, like, I don't know, white t-shirts I just, I do go through. <laughs> so I'm excited to try this one out. This is the Jockey brand, but the thing I really liked about this is that it looks like the cut is gonna be really nice. It's not too long or too cropped. And then also the neckline, it has this nice like ribbed neckline. Okay, yes, it is confirmed, this is, the most perfect, just basic white tee. You can't see my bra and I'm wearing a black bra. You can't see the bra through really. I like the long sleeves, like the neckline. It's a win. The material is nice and soft, but it's also nice and thick where I feel like this isn't gonna like show through stuff. Also has a nice little stretch. It is 5% spandex, so it's not like hard stiff. This one, you'll have to let me know what you think of the color down below because I weirdly like it, but that I'm also like, 
It makes me think of like Crayola. What was the name of that one? I feel like I probably just unlocked some childhood memories, but I love the pink color with it. It's like, it's like the Barbie pink. This one also isn't cropped. It's like full tank top. And this one came in another color as well, or maybe even a couple other colors. Casio, I feel like is having a comeback right now. Obviously, oh my God, just flung that out. So this one is water resistant, it says seven year battery. I picked up this really cute light blue. Oh yeah, this is cute. I look at that. I already have Casio watch on this arm, but yep, yeah, this is cute. Picture this with cute like colored Nikes or something, and then an all black outfit or just like neutral and then this watch. That's the vision. This dress, one thing I noticed is that this is so nice because it doesn't wrinkle. Whatever material this is, I have not experienced it wrinkling at all. Okay, did not even realize this had a slit in it, but now it's even more cute. I love this. If you're like going to a summer wedding, any summer event, but also really nice length, I won't have to get it altered. This is a total, total win. My mom's birthday is coming up and we're having like a big party. So I think this is probably what I'm gonna wear to that. Love this pink color with like the different tones in here. It almost has some like purple. I got a size small. Ooh, that's cool. This is made from 30% recycled polyester. I think they had another color, like maybe an orange in this one too. Last clothing item is this red dress and I wanted another dress that I felt good in and that was like cute and a little sexy for like dates. I have good first date and second date outfits, but if we get to the third date, <laughs> I'm like, what do I wear? I usually wear the exact same thing for like first and second dates. So I'm thinking this might be the third date outfit. I haven't tried this one on yet, so could be it could be a no. I picture this with like hair back, maybe like low ponytail to make it a little more casual, some like, gold earrings or something. If you are in the dating world, do you have your go-to date outfits? It's just nice. Then you don't have to think about it. You know, you feel good in it. You have your go-to outfit. They've never seen it before. No one else knows you're repeating it, except now the entire internet that I'm telling. All right, and then last item, I kind of destroyed this box here, getting this open, but these are deodorant wipes, which I've been testing like different brands of these. It's the Busy Company, Get the Funk, out of here deodorant wipe it says with prebiotics zinc and probiotics and these are biodegradable wipes which is really cool it just comes in like these packs so basically this could be something nice to like either throw in your bag if you're someone who brings deodorant with you or just have at the gym so if these work that'll be nice haven't tried them yet but let me know what you think so that is everything I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I feel like some of the clothing things I'm like so excited about and so excited to wear. You'll definitely be seeing them over on Instagram. You can follow along here if you aren't already. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll have everything linked down below in the description box. And again, thank you so much to Walmart for working with me. This was fun. You can check the pinned comment down below if it's easier for you to read the description box and find the links. It'll be there too. Also, someone did tell me, cause I was talking about this in another video. One of you did say that you can actually click like on mobile, you can click the title of the video, like the big title and that will open the box. I also wanted to ask, since I'm now in San Diego, I'm here for a couple months. Let me know what kind of videos you wanna see while I'm here. I'm thinking about doing like an errand running vlog, maybe something with the parents. Let me know what you would wanna see. But I love you guys. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.